when you are walking, there are people who observe you. And after observing you, something has to be done. You have to leave your old job, like I said, and come work with me. You understand what I'm saying? The church is going to take care of you. After all, where you work before, how much do they pay you? The church will take care of you. We'll take care of all your expenses. We'll give you an apartment. Yes. And we will even give you a car. Oh, my. Thank you. No, 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 no. Thank you. Thank you so much, Pastor. Ha! A car. A car is small compared to what we are going to give you. Uh, you will lead the choir. I mean, I've already said that. You will be in charge of the choir. This is my own resolution. You see, all those uh, things that I know of, I think you have to leave them. Those men who would like to goad you into things that uh, you know will not help you in life, <laughs> like the chief. <laughs> yes, you think I do not know about them. I know. But you have to leave them. You have to come to me. You will satisfy my desires, my needs, and I will satisfy yours. But, Pastor, you are a man of God. Yes, I'm a man of God. I'm, I'm happy you said a man before you say God. I'm not a God of God. A man has all the desires that you have. I mean, all the emotions, everything that you feel, I feel. But if God wants to use you to pass his message or to serve his people, who are you to say no? But the fact is that you have nothing to worry about, okay? <laughs> 